Hello and welcome to this presentation on Big Data, Intelligence and Analytics. We live in a world which produces insurmountable volume of data from different sources. We are constantly being bombarded with data, be it from our mobile phones, computers, books, reports, news, reviews, etc. What do you do when you are confronted with loads of data? Well, you can either throw it out of the window or get some valuable insights. But, how do you get valuable insights? We can make it as easy as one, two, three. First, get the raw data generated by business applications, human content and machines. Second, ask questions like what happened, where did it happen and how did it happen? Third, ask questions like why did it happen and what happens if situations change? This is a completely iterative process of using big data to generate business intelligence and then deriving business analytics. In other words, we are making sense of nonsense or finding invaluable insights from insurmountable data. So, what is the process? First stage. It all starts with big data. Data predominantly comes from three major sources. Data is generated from business applications. We humans generate loads of data in the form of reviews, comments, likes, purchase trends, to name a few. Similarly, there is loads of machine-generated data such as metadata, log files, etc. The first task is to converge all data through the process of extraction, transformation, and loading or rental. Second stage. The next stage is to understand what happened by running basic queries and standard reports. This can be achieved using simple spreadsheets or tools and gives a historical view of the events. Third stage. In this stage, we try to understand why did it happen? Through data visualization and ad hoc analysis. This will help us understand the causes, the trends and the active actions to be taken to mitigate any risks or unfavorable results in the future. Fourth stage. In this stage, we answer the question, what is happening now? This is achieved by measuring key performance indicators through metrics dashboards and scorecards. It is essentially performance management to understand real-time scenarios as they are unfolding. Fifth stage. This stage is about predictive modeling and rightfully we try to understand what might happen in the future. This is done through performance simulation using what-if scenarios and analyze the impending risks in order to mitigate them proactively. At this stage, the level of insight is detailed and scientific to ensure accuracy within reasonable limits of error. The whole process could take a very long time if done manually. Let us now preview some samples of data insights derived through visualization tools like ClientView, Tableau and Spreadsheets. With the availability of visualization tools such as ClientView, Tableau and others, we may be able to expedite the whole process and make more informed decisions for the future. Here is a sample quarter on quarter performance.